Hello and welcome for uh, this video tutorial uh, on balancing of chemical equation. Today we are going to look at uh, an equation for the reaction between hydrogen gas and nitrogen gas uh, to produce uh, ammonia. To produce ammonia. This is the formula for ammonia. Now, to be able to do this, or to be able to equate the number of atoms uh, on both sides of the reactant and the, pro the product, in this case the product is ammonia, we are going to use uh, models that will show uh, individual atoms. For example, uh, this model here uh, represents uh, nitrogen gas. You can see we have two H here, two hydrogen atoms here, and this one represents uh, this one here, so it represents the hydrogen gas. We have another model here that represents uh, nitrogen gas. We have two nitrogen uh, atoms here, combined together by covalent bonds. We also have um, this molecule, which is uh, ammonia, and we are going to put it there. Now we can be able to see clearly individual atoms on both sides of this equation. You can see that we have two uh, hydrogen atoms on this side, three on this side. We have two atoms of nitrogen on this side and one on this side. Now, we are going to start balancing the atoms, individual atoms now. On this side we have two, while on this side we have three. So, what we do is that we are going to add another molecule of hydrogen. Remember, all the gases must react uh, in terms of molecule. You cannot have one atom of hydrogen reacting or in an equation. So, we are going to add a whole molecule of hydrogen on that side, making one, two, three, four. There are four now atoms of hydrogen. Uh, on this side, we have three. Now, on this side now, we need one to make four. But we cannot, as we have said, we cannot add one atom of hydrogen on this side. So what we do is that we are going to add a whole molecule of ammonia. So now we have one, two, three, four, five, six. We have six atoms of hydrogen. Well, on this side we have four. Now to make this uh, six, we are going to add another molecule of hydrogen, which have two atoms of uh, of hydrogen, and that means we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Just as in this side we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Now, hydrogen atoms are on this side of the reactant are balanced. We also have hydrogen atoms on this side of the product that are balanced. Now, let us concentrate now on nitrogen. On this side, we have a molecule of nitrogen, which is two atoms of uh, nitrogen. And on this side now, we have one and two. So, the number of hydrogen atoms is balancing. We have two on this side and two on this side. So, we can say... We can put our coefficients now by counting the number of molecules. One, two, three. So we have three molecules of hydrogen. One, two, three. On that side, we have one molecule of uh, nitrogen, no problem. And then we have two molecules of one, two, one, two molecules of ammonia. Now our equation is balanced. When you, if you can multiply, you multiply three by two, you get six. One, two, three, four, five, six. These are two. If you multiply, 2 times nitrogen is 1, you get 2 nitrogen, and 2 times 3, you get 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 atoms of, um, of uh, hydrogen. Now, when a reaction takes place, there are some activities that usually take place on the side of the reactant for us to be able to produce the product. Now, there is what we call board breaking and board formation, new board formation. These atoms are going to, the boards are going to break, and then we form new uh, boards here to form new products. Now, for us to be able to see that, we're going to replace uh, our molecules here with uh, detachable uh, molecules that can, we can be able to detach, uh -huh, like that. And also, we are going to replace this one with that one here. So, when this reaction is taking place now in the beaker, these are the activities that take place. These molecules will break into individual atoms, that is board breaking, and followed by movement of these atoms here and they join together to form new boats that is one board of ammonia while this one comes here 
and forms another uh, other boats here. So we have one, two molecules of ammonia as we have on this side. So we have seen what actually happens in the beaker when a reaction is taking place. Boat breakage and boat formation. Uh, I hope you have enjoyed this tutorial and it has been beneficial. Uh, we meet next time for more uh, balancing of more chemical equations. Remember to subscribe so that you'll be the first one to be notified when we upload another video. Thank you very much. We meet in the other video.